Designing a reinforced concrete structure is very complicated. There are too many factors that can affect the performance of the structures and at worst it can cause the structures to become unfit to be used. These factors including the materials, the loot, the exposures, the durability and other factors. The purpose of the design is to achieve an acceptable probability that a structure will remain fit to be used. To ensure that, we need to set some boundaries for the design. And these boundaries are known as the limit states. It is on the basis that as long as the limit state is not reached, the structure will be safe, at least to a certain acceptable probability. Basically, there are two types of limit state, the ultimate limit state and the serviceability limit states. The ultimate limit states require the structure to withstand the loop safely against the collapse of the structures. It also consider the probability of the member undergo buckling, overturning, accidental damage, and etc. As long as the ultimate limit state is not achieved, the structures will not collapse and it can be used to withstand load safely. The serviceability limit state is related to the well-being and the good conditions of the structures. As long as serviceability limit state is not achieved, the appearance, the efficiency, the durability and even the comfort of the occupants can be ensured. The three main criteria to be checked within the serviceability limit state include the deflections, cracking, and durability. The other criteria include the excessive vibrations, fatigue, fire resistance, and other special circumstances such as earthquake resistance. In the design of a reinforced concrete structures, we need to check the structures against the ultimate limit state so that it doesn't collapse and check against the serviceability limit state so that the quality of the structures will remain consistent throughout its design life. As for the design process, normally we will check against the ultimate limit state first then followed by the serviceability limit state checking.